This month of Elul, אני לדודי ודודי לי. אני לדודי ודודי לי, אלול. א', אני לדודי ל', ו', ל', אלול. And the end of it, אני finish with יוד, לדודי finish with יוד, ודודי finish with יוד, לי finish with יוד. יוד, 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 40 days. What you can do in 40 days between ראש, between ראש חודש אלול and יום כיפור, in one day, what you can do, you cannot do in the entire year combined. Why? Because the Torah said, Dirshu Hashem be yoto karov. Search for me when I'm close to you. When I'm close to you in these days. Hashem, it's like, you know, like sometimes you catch the judge in a very good mood. Judges are people. You come to court, most of the time is panim tisha be'av. His face, tisha be'av. Never smile, not compliment, don't have patience for anyone, cut everyone. But today, his daughter finally got engaged after 50 years. <laughs> so he's so relieved that she's going to move out of his home finally. So he came to the court with a very good mood today. Even big criminals come today. What happened? Listen, buddy, I'm willing to give you a second chance. Do something with your life. Three months probation. Three months probation? It's 30 years prison. <laughs> Not today. This story, it's a little bit similar to what Hashem does with us. Elul, that's the mood. But do something with that. Some people, slichot. I, have, I know someone, secular guy. Secular, Moroccan, Israeli, secular. Moroccans, they come from religious tradition, you know. If not the parents, the grandparents for sure. Everyone was religious there, back there. So every year around this time, I didn't get the call this year yet, but any day he's going to call. He said, tell me, when the slichot are starting? Slichot, Michal El Shabbat, the biggest thief, he, he asked about the slichot. So I asked him once, why someone like you care about slichot? So he said to me, I love the music. <laughs> We laugh at him, we are like this. Some people come, Ha Tanu Good thing they don't open the whiskey in the middle. Good thing she didn't bring Gondi and make a meal, Baruch Hashem. Avinu Malkenu Avinu Ata. No? Persian wedding, Baruch Hashem. The real slichot is better you do five, ta- five minutes slichot with tears and broken heart than an hour singing like you in a party. The slichot, it's when you, when you say these words, you have to feel Hashem Rachem. Your heart goes 500 a minute. You have to be nervous. You have to feel the fear. David Amelech felt the fear from Hashem. We're not going to feel fear. We have millions, millions of reasons to feel fear. He maybe had maybe, maybe one, maybe, not even. We had millions of reasons. Modesty fell. Generosity fell. Shabbat fell. Kosher food fell. Modesty in behaving fell. Integrity fell. Honesty in a business fell. Loyalty fell. Ungratefulness, big fell. Everything fell. All this list, I, I have another 50 things to say. Prayers, fail. Learning Torah, fail. Watching your eyes, fail. Getting rid of all the nonsense from your home, television, internet, all kinds of garbage. Big fail. Lashon Ara. Fail, it's a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. Depressing. Depressing, but there's one light, one point of light. That there's an opportunity to show Hashem, I really care. Do you know how great it is to stand in front of Hashem? You and Him alone. Hashem, 
you know I'm this, and you know I'm that, and you know I'm that, and you know I'm this. All I want from you is one request. Please, I'm not asking for you for money. Not, nothing. Nothing materialistic. Nothing. I just beg you, help me to be close to you. That's all. Just for that you pray. And you'll see how your life is going to change.